All right, guys, welcome back. This time we are gonna head east to check out Court Sam. Sam, I think, yeah, okay. So if you guys are looking to do any grinding or anything, um, don't bother grinding here. Enemies here do not give um, a good enough amount of Gela. Mm, not much experience either, so this place isn't really worth it. If you want to grind, go back to Volcan and Trap for a moment. But otherwise, here's a Photosphere. Um, once this is gone, you're gonna want to come back here in order to get a rune. So yeah, keep that in mind. Um, let's exit. Let's continue going south because there's nothing we can do here. Oh yes, another thing: random encounters are are um, in a possibility while you're inside the golem. So yeah, happy days. Now these shallow waters are crossable now. Or it'll be cool though if if you actually seen the golem actually go inside. That'd be cool. So anyways, continue heading south, then go into the town there called Court Sim. Okay, so there are items scattered about here, so we'll go get them all. None there. There are items to the left, um, west, east, and west, north, and east. That's it. What the hell? Could have sworn there was something here. Hmm, interesting. Okay, so northeast. Check around here. Yep, yeah. crest graph. Excellent. Might as well go north. There are, I believe, apples around here somewhere. Here we are. Agile apple. Okay. Then go south from here. Go up. Go right. Don't get any spells just yet. Not really useful. Go just wonder something around here. Nope. Okay. Okay. There should be an item here somewhere. Wow, I believe my memory is faulty. No, I'm right. Okay, so there's a power apple. Now, I believe there's a mystic apple around here somewhere. I head south. Ah, here it is, mystic apple. Okay, so that is it. You get an agile apple, gela, and a power apple. Very useful stuff. So, it's been a while since we've actually gotten mystic apples. So, we'll give a Cecilia power apple to Jack here. Jackie boy. The reason why I give him power apples, now I can reveal it to you, is because, well, I can't reveal it to you. Um... Like I said, he's a powerhouse. Basically, Jack is, but um, Rudy, Rudy's pa Rudy gets most of his power from the attack power of his arms. So that's why I put, that's why I give um, Jack all the powers because his 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 arms um, abilities here are dependent upon his own power, not um, the upgradable power that you can get from Rudy's arms. So, anyways, once you're done, head due north into this house here. Go down the stairs and talk to talk to this man here. I am Nikolai Maxwell. I am the Armsmeister in this tiny village. Long ago, I was one of the six who studied at the old man's labs. The Zeppet Roughnight Laboratory led in the study of ancient technology. And you? <gasps> what? What? Rudy Roughnight? Oh my god, we know his last name now. That is awesome. You're the old man's grandchild? Sorry, we used to call Miss Meister Zeppet the old man. How is he? It's been close to 15 years. Alright, so we're learning a bit more about Rudy's background. Rudy starts to talk about the, his dream chaser days before he met Jack and Cecilia. Zeppet Roughnight. He thought of Zeppet as his father. He was an old dream chaser who had raised Rudy since infancy. During their travels, Zeppet taught Rudy the life of a dream chaser, but most importantly, he gave Rudy a heart, a heart to protect the ones he loved. One day, the inevitable happened. The old man's traveling days came to an end. Rudy was now tasting the true meaning of being alone. If you watch the original cut, well, the introductory, the introduction cutscene, you'll notice that this is the hill that you've originally seen Rudy on. Rudy buried the remains of the old dream chaser on a hill that the old man was fond of. The rest is history. 
that's basically his um journeys from s surf onwards. I'm sorry to hear that. He was... That's quite an arm you've got there. Do you know how to use it properly? I guess the arm would not have synchronized with you if you did not know how. My daughter Jane is also capable of synchronizing with an arm, but not nearly as powerful as what you have here. Looky here! Papa, I'm home. What are you guys doing at my house? Jane, do you know these people? No, no, Papa. I met them just a little while ago. Why are you in such a hurry? I'll be upstairs. Please make yourself at home. Jane is a good daughter. It's because of her that I can keep the orphanage running. Go to the southeast and cross the shallow water. There you'll find the epitaph of the sea wind. It's an, uncomplete, it's an uncompleted tower we used in the research of a flight machine. The research Meister Zeppet and myself left behind may be junk to some, but you might find a use for some of it. Take this key. It may look funky, but it will get you inside. Many of Zeppet's belongings from before Rudy was born are still there. Alright, now we have that, we're going to head here and get the hearty apple. And just to show you guys how strong the rock launcher gets, I will um, modify it. So, here we go. Don't you? As you can see, it's it's at, the attack bar gets raised by quite a lot. So that's already, oops, that's already, it's already been raised by 50, 85, or no, 85, yes, no, 80, jeez, can't count, um, 110, uh, 145, and 107, 80. One more. And 200, no, 220, yeah. Actually, maxed. Yeah. Okay, so now that that's max, upgrade the hit percentage. You're going to want this thing to hit. Because if, if it has a low hit percentage, you're going to want to um, use it with force arm lock on. So just, so it, uh, just so it always hits. Okay. So, yeah. I'll get back to you once I'm done fully upgrading this thing. Alright guys, I'm back. Now, as you can see, the attack bar went to 250, hit percentage 89%, and unfortunately, I don't have enough um, Gela to upgrade Bullet one more time, but 10 is actually just an, is enough for Rocket Launcher. This thing is so powerful that you only need, basically, need one shot for, ran, for random enemies and for bosses, pretty much like five, five shots. So yeah, um, that is Rocket Launcher nearly maxed out. Okay, so now that, now that you're done that, go up. Up here, um, you can talk to Calamity Jane if you wish, but don't worry about it. You next place we're gonna go to is Epitaph C. But for that, you're gonna want actually no. No, there are no item, there are no weapon shops around here, so don't bother. Before that, though, if um, you're gonna want to restock your ammunition if you have been upgrading your arms and rest if you need to. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next episode as we traverse Epitaph C.